made America's favorite cookie. Friday is National Chocolate Chip Cookie Day. We have a whole lot of cookie monsters here at Fox <laughs> 8. We're sharing our favorite recipes this morning. We're starting off with Jordan Browns. I've heard so much about these cookies. So these are my favorite to make because I am a chocolate chip cookie aholic. So okay. <laughs> I love making chocolate chip cookies. I love eating chocolate chip cookies. So these are my specialty. I've perfected them. Y over you're time. sharing a few of your secrets. Yes, yes. So it's it's a really simple recipe, just like the ones you would find on the back of the chocolate chip cookie package yes. or in a cookbook. But I have just a couple of tricks. Like instead of chocolate chips, I like to use chocolate chunks. So okay. I'll get a chocolate bar and cut it up and kind of mix it with the chocolate chunks or either sub or with the chocolate chips and substitute it or. Um, mix them together. So, and I've noticed that that makes a big difference. All right, you're showing me your cookies too. You got a little sprinkling of something on the top. This is another yes. little tip you like. So, I like to sprinkle just a little bit of salt on top to give it that mm. like sweet and salty contrast, and it just elevates the cookie. Show, show them. They're, they're beautiful cookies. Point? Oh, there we go. And Look then how pretty those you're are. You're going to see mine later on. Mine are almost like tall. Yours are all spread out. You have two tricks for that. Yes. Yeah, so one is to melt the butter, like okay. completely melt it so that it's liquefied. Another, and this really sounds silly, but it's really simple. I just slam the pan down as soon as they come <laughs> out of the oven. Just slam it down. I have never heard of that technique, <laughs> but I'm definitely trying it. I've learned so much about cookies. I make them. Emily Birds is coming up next. Cindy Farmers is coming up as well. And you're going to find all these recipes on myfox8.com. Emily, I've heard your 